Welcome to CNN News 18 with me Ayushman Singh Jamwal. We begin the bulletin with some breaking news coming in. The veteran poet and lyricist Javed Akhtar at an event asked people to chant Jai Siya Ram and says that Ram and Sita are the cultural heritage of India. He says and I quote, although I am an atheist, I consider Ram and Sita to be the wealth of this country. That's why I came here. Ramayana is our cultural heritage. It is the subject of your interest. I am proud to have been born in the land of Ram and Sita. When we talk about Maryada Purushottam, it is Ram and Sita that come to mind. Listen in. statement coming in from Javed Akhtar who says that Ram and Sita are central to Indian culture. I'm joined by Vinaya Deshpande on the broadcast. So Vinaya, this point has been made by Javed Akhtar time and again that there are certain aspects of Indian culture that go well beyond religious lines. One of them, remember yesterday when the MNS was celebrating Deepotsa, which was the beginning of Diwali, that was when both Javed Akhtar as well as Salim were the chief guests for that event and that is where Javed Akhtar was speaking. He categorically says that even for an atheist like him, uh, uh, the story of Ramayana or Mahabharat is a matter of pride. He goes on to talk about Ramayana, he goes on to uh, talk about his experience of songs about Ramayan saying that it's a matter of great pride that uh, this entire culture that is uh, that identifies us as an Indian there would be no Indian uh, who would not know his culture and whoever it is irrespective of whichever religion he or she belongs to clearly it's a matter of pride uh, that uh, it is the culture of Ram and Sita that they inherit uh, so an important statement there by Javed Akhtar who has reiterated the same thing that he has said time and again yesterday was the occasion of Deepot so, uh, the celebration of the beginning of Diwali the platform was given by MNS and he was present uh, where Ritesh Deshmukh was taking his uh, interview uh, the famous Javed uh, Salim Javed uh, duo that we saw uh, Raj Thakre was also present on the day factory. Right, and Vinaya, at the same time, Javed Akhtar addressing a crowd ahead of Diwali is something that he has also pointed out is central to Indian culture, where everyone is included when it comes to the ethos of what, uh, you know, defines India. Now, at the same time, while Javed Akhtar says that Ram and Sita is central to Indian culture, we also, a few uh, months back, had Nasiruddin Shah, who said that Indian Muslims should reject radicalism these kind of statements coming in from uh, from uh, personalities like Javed Akhtar and Nasiruddin Shah always get a lot of flack from certain sections of the Muslim community. Uh, well, yes, and we have seen that uh, time and again, uh, someone like Javed Akhtar has taken a stance which is uh, which 
showcases the culture of this country and uh, you know with this a uh, statement that was particularly coming up he spoke about uh, the significance of prabhu shri ramchandra about uh, ramayan about the significance of ramayan in indian ethos speaks about uh, you know an ideal god how it is he also goes ahead to say jai shri ram uh, along with the crowd when uh, they speak about ramayan jolly but uh, when you look at the political context of it clearly uh, there there is Uh, a kind of backlash that we have seen some certain sections when such statements are made, but this is not the first time that Zawed Akhtar has said so. In the same breath, he has gone ahead to also say that he is an atheist, and despite being an atheist, something that's such a pa- part of a rich culture and heritage makes him proud as an Indian. Uh, clearly, uh, showcases that he has reiterated his stance with respect to Indian culture, uh, Indian ethos, and uh, what. Uh, the country inherits in terms of uh, the uh, social narrative package. right also vinaya this comes right ahead of the inauguration of the grand ram temple which is supposed to be uh, is going to be a huge event where the government is inviting personalities from all walks of life to be a part of that iconic moment in indian history and these kind of sentiments coming in from personalities like javed akhtar uh, really highlight the significance of the inauguration of the ram mandir which is set to take place next year So this conversation was uh, the Deepotsav or Diwali, which is also believed to be the time when Prabhu Sri Ramchandra came back home after his vanvas, and that is uh, the whole context in which uh, this conversation was taking place. Uh, Javed Akhtar was asked about the songs as well that he had written about uh, Ram and Ramayan, and uh, he has gone ahead to speak about. Uh, how uh, you know uh, the progress right. when i am sorry to interrupt i'm joined by vinod bansal of the vhp who's joining us on the broadcast uh, bansal sahab aap ye statement kaise dekhte hain javed akhtar se jo aaya hai ki ram aur sita indian culture ka ek ahem is hissa hai ha koi nayi baat nahi hai it's a very good uh, ki jo log uh, kabhi kabhi jo ram ka virodh karte the ya jo ram ko nakarte the ya jo log us community ko kabhi kabhi belong kar jate the वो लोग सभी रामत्व की तरफ लौट रहे हैं हमने जब राम जन्मभूमि का निर्णय आया था 9 नवंबर 2019 को उसी समय कहा था कि अब हम देश पर में देश पर में बोले विश्व में रामत्व का प्रसार करेंगे राम के जीवन से लोगों को जोड़ेंगे हमें खुशी है कि वो सब लोग जो है रामत्व की तरफ लौट रहे हैं भगवान राम चूंकि उनके भी पूर्वज हैं बाई रिलीजन ही में भी डिफरेंट ही में बिलोंग्स टू डिफरेंट कम्युनिटी बट द क्वेश्चन इज दैट राम बिलोंग्स टू एवरीबडी ऑफ द कंट्री अब कैसा भारत के अंदर कोई भी व्यक्ति ऐसा नहीं है जिनके पूर्वज राम न हो तो इसलिए लेकिन उसको राम को नकारना और राम से दूरी बना के रखना एक एक पर्टिकुलर पॉलिटिकल सिस्टम का एक पार्ट सा बन गया था उनको लग रहा था कि भाई हिंदुओं को गाली देना या हिंदुत्व को गाली देना या राम को नकारना ये उनके लिए प्राइड प्राउड मूवमेंट बनता था अब नाउ दे आर गोइंग कमिंग बैक टू दी फोर और वो अच्छी बात है मैं शुभकामना देता हूँ और साधुवाद देता हूँ ऐसे लोगों को और जो लोग अभी भी दूरी बना के रखे हुए वो लोग भी बहुत हैं क्योंकि अब राम जी का मंदिर नहीं बन रहा है राष्ट्र मंदिर बन रहा है जी पर, के अंदर जो जी पर विनोद बंसल साहब जावेद अख्तर जी ने कभी भी राम के खिलाफ कभी बात नहीं की है वो बहुत टाइम से ये कह, कह के आ रहे हैं कि राम और सीता इंडियन कल्चर का एक अहम हिस्सा है पर ये राम मंदिर के इनोग्रेशन से पहले ऐसा स्टेटमेंट आना ये आई कंप्लीटली अग्री विद यू मैं आपसे सहमति बनाता हूं इस बात पे कि एक नेशनल इवेंट हो जाएगा अगर पर्सनालिटीज जावेद अख्तर जी की तरह ऐसे बात करते हैं कि राम और सीता इंडियन कल्चर का एक अहम हिस्सा है वो जो रेडिकल रेडिकल ऑर्गेनाइजेशन का जो लैंग्वेज है उन्हें कंप्लीटली निकाल रहे हैं वो निश्चित रूप से देखिए मैं ये नहीं कह रहा कि जावेद अख्तर जी ने क्या कहा जावेद अख्तर जी कैसे हैं मैं कहता हूँ सबको लौटना चाहिए जो लोग अभी भी दूरी बना के रखे हुए हैं दे शुड ऑल्सो कम बैक टू दी फोर एंड दे शुड ऑल्सो बिलीव दैट राम इज अवर इंसेस्टर्स और दूसरी बात देखिए कि अभी जो राम मंदिर बन रहा है वो सारी सारी पुरानी जो नकारात्मक सोच थी उसको दूर करके अब देश पॉजिटिविटी की तरफ बढ़ रहा है देश सांस्कृतिक उत्थान की तरफ बढ़ रहा है देश में एक नवोत्थान आ रहा है आप देखिए सांस्कृतिक नवोत्थान की तरफ देश बढ़ रहा है प्रत्येक आप देखिए इस राम मंदिर के माध्यम से पिछली बार हमने जो निधि समर्पण अभियान किया था ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी वन ट्वेंटी वन में उस समय बेसिकली बासठ करोड़ लोगों को जोड़ा था अभी जो अक्षत इन्विटेशन जो हम पूरे देश पर लेके जा रहे हैं 
वो भी करोड़ों लोगों के साथ करोड़ों लोगों को राम जी के साथ जोड़ेगा पूरा 